we will implement a sound fiscal management. Tax administration reforms will be in place to increase revenue collection. Expenditure priorities will be realigned and spending efficiency will be improved to immediately address the economic scarring arising from the effects of COVID-19 and also to prepare for future shocks. Productivity enhancing investments will be promoted. Our country must become an investment destination. I will not preside over any process that will abandon even one square inch of territory of the Republic of the Philippines to any foreign power. hindi nakakalimutan ng mamamayan ang uh, legacy ng human rights violations at corruption ng Marcos dictatorship. Sa kalagayang magbibigay ng unang sona si Marcos Jr. No? Uh, hindi maaring burahin yan. Uh, kailangang singilin pa rin ang mga Marcos uh, sa kanilang mga naging kasalanan sa bayan.